Okay. I wanted to play guitar first. Yep, I wanted to play guitar first, and it just wasn't working out. And uh, my father played drums, and my brother played drums, so I kind of just, I went that route because it was, the drums were there, and the rhythm was there, and it just worked out better for me. So. Who was your first uh, exposure? Who really got you interested? What performer, what band, what album, what song? Oh, <laughs> that's a tough one. Uh, I would just say uh, jazz in general. Okay. You know, just because so my dad grew up on it and Cootie had me exposed to it. Cootie, Cootie, that, that's a name to throw out there. It influenced me pretty big time. Cootie Harris. Yeah. So. Did you have lessons from people other than your father and Cootie? No, no, and, and with them, I didn't, especially with Cootie, I didn't have like your regular, you know, teacher, student. It was more like grandfather, grandson relationship, you know, and he, he showed me a lot of stuff that he didn't show his other students, you know, in a regular, uh, you know, lesson format. He showed me a lot of like different tricks so he became a real mentor to you. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. I used to, because I used to actually live in the same apartment as him for uh, like a few years with my dad hmm. down at the Tar Mansion in Meadville. And so how many years did you end up uh, getting lessons from uh, Cootie or master classes it, it, or whatever? It, it, it was on and off for twenty something years. Hmm. Yeah. At what point in your life did you think that you had come of age as a drummer? Honestly, not till about three years ago. Uh, how old are you now? I'm 39. I'll be 40 in September. So how many years were you playing drums before you hit that point of feeling decent about well, it? Well, I, I started in 87. So let's see, I would say about 2016. So about 30 years. Yeah, yeah. And then all of a sudden, it, it just seemed like one day I woke up and every, all my work I put into it just seemed to pay off, you hmm. know. So you play a lot of different styles and you listen constantly yes. to a lot of different styles. Yes. Do you have favorite styles? Uh, I would say, oh God, it depends on what day. <laughs> <laughs> Depends on what day. Really. Cool. So, uh, do you have any comments about playing with you know Phil and David, this band? Oh, that it, I, I don't even know where to go with that because it's just it's been so wonderful playing in the V band. Um, this it makes sense to me because there's so many different styles involved. You know, this makes sense that I I, I fell into this spot somehow and uh, it just makes sense to me because we go over to we go everywhere and that that's how I am musically you know cool if you had one suggestion to offer to aspiring musicians what would it be uh, don't go with the herd you know what I mean? Try to, try to, like, you gotta, if, everybody's got their own voice. And what works for me isn't gonna work for, you know, the next person. So you gotta, like, just find your own magic and that, work that formula that works for you. Cool, thanks.